This is Hasbro's Global Day of Joy. It's an amazing day where people all over the world have come together. 93% of our workforce do 240 projects and to impact 95,000 children all over the world. Join us as we follow Hasbro employees around the world through three unique projects, a school renovation, an upgrade to a hydrotherapy center, and a mission to complete random acts of kindness within the community, where teams will compete to win a grant for a local charity. You are giving a gift to children that will give them hope and will give them dreams. All part of the 2016 Global Day of Joy. At corporate headquarters in Pawtucket, Rhode Island, the first ever Mission Kindness Challenge is about to get underway. Hi. The first mission? For each of the four teams to purchase items for adopted families they've been paired with through the Pawtucket Boys and Girls Club. After that, they'll race against time and each other to complete random acts of kindness sent out from the command center back at Hasbro. These random acts are worth points towards a final score. The winning team receives a grant to be donated to a local charity. Four teams signed up to take a chance and they just received their assignments and they're very excited. So in the box are gonna be random act of kindness suggestions. Go sing some Christmas carols in a local school and you get points for doing these. So the first part of your mission in your box will be a list from a family that's been connected with the Pawtucket Boys and Girls Club. So here's our gift cards, random acts of kindness, points of interest, and shopping locations. And there's our family. Let's go. Meanwhile, in Peru, renovations sponsored by Hasbro through grant money are underway at the Hydrotherapy Center at the San Juan de Dios Clinic in Lima. Today, old walls that limited patients' ability to get in and out of shower stalls and changing rooms are being removed to make larger spaces with handicap accessibility while fresh tile will give the center a bright new look. In Providence, Rhode Island, students at the Roger Williams Middle School are about to see their hard work pay off because their kind acts earn them the distinction of becoming one of Hasbro's Be Fearless, Be Kind champion schools. And they've earned a surprise game day. Hasbro has impacted our community here at Roger Williams with the donations that they make, with their time and effort that they're putting into this game day, really reaching out to our kids and our families. Rules of Kindness is a Hasbro initiative to bring kindness into our schools. And we did different lessons with them. We had warm-ups. We had this game where we gave them a scenario of some type of bullying in the school, and they had to come up with one way in which they could combat that, one way in which they could be kind in that scenario. These kids have to grow up a lot faster than your average kid should. They deserve a break. A lot of times, our students don't get the chance to be kids. And today, they're in the gym and they're playing Connect Four. They're all playing together and they're being kids. But more than just fun and games, the day also included empathy developing activities aimed at helping kids learn not only to understand empathy, but also what it means to relate to and stand up for each other. Take a big step forward if you speak a language other than English. Take a big step forward if you've ever stood up for something you thought was right. Today was just awesome, but then to add on positive environment, a space that they can actually have good positive interactions with adults adding on the toys that they're getting at the end of the day. Those things really motivate me, motivate the school to sit back and see, okay, people are acknowledging that our students are worth it. You know, the little setup in the gym was really, really nice. When I saw it, I was like, wow, it looks amazing. I can speak for students and they really loved it. The City Here core members are super excited about today's game day, but little do they know, their own surprise is right around the corner. We have four teams out in the field right now, all doing random acts of kindness. We're doing our first random act of kindness. The competition is heating up as the mission kindness teams get down to the final minutes. Our leaderboard is updated. The command center fires off a series of timed challenges. What is that? 15 say, minutes to purchase a gift card and oh, give it to the next easy. person in line. This is a gift card for $25. We're from Hasbro. We're spending oh, wow. joy today. I oh. just wanted to give that to you and your daughter for the holidays. Oh, thank you. Uh, right now I'm adding another submission here, so we should see it pop up. Uh, there it is, season greetings. Challenges ranged from handing out gift cards Thank you. to filling tanks with gas. We want to pay for your gas. What do you want for free? Nothing. nothing, literally nothing. And with coffee, all to spread joy and earn points for their team. We know our game. <laughs> we'll show you the Enjoy. Hold the card and let us take a picture of it. Absolutely. Here, get on the picture, Neil. Uh, you there too. There you go, in the picture. <laughs> I'd like to pass this on. I'm pass it forward. It was awesome to get a free coffee from a stranger. The next challenges came in and the envelope says, the envelope Go to says, you have 15 minutes to purchase some art supplies, crayons, paints, paper, etc., and give them to the first child you see. I have some stuff for you. My name's Jason. We got 
all different art supplies for you. We got some chalk. Marker. Last year she was a foster child. This year we adopted her, so this will be our Christmas together. One of our random acts of kindness that we uh, could do today was to call a veteran and thank them for their services. So what a great opportunity for me to call my dad. Thank you, Mr. Brewster. Thanks for your service. We really appreciate all you've done. But even with all the kindness in the air, there's still lots of shopping to be done for the adopted families from the Boys and Girls Club. So we're already up to six thousand dollars. <laughs> and it's Tom and Duncan's fault. Pants, small, eighteen slim. Oh, those look that awesome. Works right. These leather. Or... Did you smell them? I did. I wanted to see if they were leather. You yeah, smelled the gloves. Yeah. And then the sweatshirt. Yep. We got something for everybody on the list, but we um, are about to find out if we're over. Actually, that's not bad. All right, we have two minutes left. As the final acts of kindness are completed, the command center determines the winner, but everyone else will have to wait to find out. Back at the hydrotherapy center at the San Juan de Dios Clinic in Peru, renovations are finally complete, and today, the Hasbro team is getting the center sparkling and adding the finishing touches, all in time for the grand opening. Now that the center is officially open, the team cannot wait to find out what the therapists, patients, and their families think of the new space. With the game day in full swing over at the Roger Williams Middle School, a different renovation project is also underway. For the school's City Year Corps members, who take a year out of their lives to work in schools in high poverty communities, helping to bridge the gap between the support the students actually need and what the schools are resourced to provide. Hasbro supports the City Year AmeriCorps program um, at the Roger Williams Middle School. Today, over 50 Hasbro employees are redoing their community and staff space. We've purchased all new furniture, tons of painting. We did a deep cleaning, and we're providing a great kitchenette area with a sitting area so that they can kind of come and have conversations. Hasbro felt it was really important to honor the students of the City Year program as they're doing such great work in the community. They take a year out of their day-to-day -day life to support these children, that their needs may not specifically be met within the school system. They were part of the Be Fearless, Be Kind initiative. I would think of City Year as kind, Miss Lindsay helps me with math, and I'm sure she can help tons and tons of children all around the world. They take us out for lunches, and they, and they talk to us. They have taught me kindness. I've been here for four years, so it's awesome to be able to see the space that they do all the hard work in tutoring students is getting renovated, it's getting painted, it's getting, I believe, I believe the type of treatment that it deserves. <laughs> The Mission Kindness teams have all made their way back to the Pawtucket Boys and Girls Club, armed with full shopping bags. Now we're here at the Boys and Girls Club in Pawtucket, and we're going to wrap all the gifts. We put everything together and have many people that help to plan this day, but really the spirit of the employees and the enthusiasm that they have for giving back and making a difference, that's what this day is all about. This was our inaugural Take a Chance, and it was amazing watching you guys play today. Watching the joy in your faces, watching the joy in the people's faces that you guys were actually delivering the product to was amazing. We do have a winner after all of that. Following the grand opening, the Hasbro team wasted no time getting ready for a celebration for parents and patients who will benefit from the new hydrotherapy center. The party was complete with snacks, entertainment, and of course, toys. Para nosotros el poder haber hecho esta obra de hidroterapia es realmente un orgullo y un honor y estamos muy felices de poder haber apoyado en ella. Agradecimiento enorme para la clínica, para Hasbro y para la Teletón por haber hecho este cambio posible. Los vestidores también son mucho más grandes ahora, pueden entrar muy fácilmente a una silla de ruedas. Antes la silla de ruedas entraba pero habría que calzarlo justo para la puerta. El baño también es más grande, tiene barandas también para los niños que se pueden parar y usan sandalias, pueden agarrarse con total comodidad. Yo agradezco mucho a la Teletón y a Hasbro por darnos la oportunidad de que nuestros niños puedan continuar y puedan recuperarse y de esa manera puedan rehabilitar e integrar a la sociedad. El, el hecho de haber podido contar con tanta asistencia, hemos tenido más de 200 niños, es decir, 500 o 600 personas acá, realmente nos llena de orgullo y nos da mucha felicidad el poder aportar gente que también viene con mucha humildad y el poder devolverle todo lo que la sociedad nos da realmente es un honor. ¿no? Providence, it's almost time for the big reveal at Roger Williams Middle School. 
and the City Year team still has no idea that their space has been completely made over. Asbro employees, armed with signs showing their appreciation, fill the new space. I wanted to do something to surprise you as a way to say thank you for giving up at least a year to the children in Providence. Well, we had no idea uh, leading up to this, you know, to this event. So it was really exciting uh, you know, for us and obviously for the kids. The Hasbro team has never ceased to amaze me and I want to thank each and every one of you elves. It's become a magical space. It matches the magic of the conversations that go on here. The students are going to just feel so much um, better about coming here and I can't wait for them to see it. You lead by example and you are the reason that your team members can feel so passionate and dedicated to doing things across the globe. You guys guys embody what the Global Day of Joy is. But actually, it was like the Global 48 Hours. <laughs> a Global Day of Joy reaffirms the core principles of our company, and it makes us grateful to be part of this great organization of people who are committed to making the world a better place for children and their families. Around the world, hundreds of other projects were also taking place. And joy was being spread across the globe. This has been great, this whole experience with Hasbro. I don't know if anybody's ever done anything like this before. Such good souls do such great work. And so thank you. Thank you. Juan.